thank God today. Thank God today. Still declaring the righteousness of God. Still declaring the second. The second is the door that's creating better to come in. The word of oath creating better to come in. And yes, it's not for everybody, but it's not good news to everybody. But this is the declaring of the second to come in. And that's of purpose. That's of better hope. That's of the reason that the first was to come to know. And don't take that in your natural understanding. Don't lean to your own understanding right there. This is 5, 25, 24. As I said in the beginning, this is about the second being established. The reason the second was to be established. The purpose the second needed to be established. The reason... The reason Miriam and Aaron became leprous. The reason Miriam and Aaron became leprous. Any of Say excuse me. This is today. And um, we're not allowing no one or nothing to interrupt the word when the word is coming forth. This is today. And Hebrews 4, 7 talks about those that's hearing David's voice as well. Um, we know that there's many voices, but the word also tells us to know the voices, to know the voices. Um, as the scripture says that they no longer want to hear the voice, hear the word at the time that the word is saying that the one speaking from heaven, they will not be able to, they will not be able to resist. Hearing the one speaking from heaven, this is a glory today. This is a glory because it's coming from a fulfilled word that says that he will reveal his righteousness, his glory. These, we are in the era of good things that require a, a, a new priesthood that could cover new things, good things. So, as I said before, we're not going to let anything hinder the word when the word is trying to come forth, whether it's a baby voice, whether it's some noise in the background, it don't matter. The word is speaking consecrated words, speak of better things than able today. Come from Deborah Yeshua today. Um, this is about things of the spirit, not physical, not looking for something by sight. This is not looking for something by sight today. And we have to accept that we have to embrace the, the promises. We have to embrace this grace that's coming. We have to embrace these steps of Jesus Yeshua that's coming. Jacob was given the word. Jacob was given the word. They they were given, they knew the judgment and the statutes, but Jacob was given the word. And today, he is in the heavenly kingdom because the Bible says that Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob are sitting in his kingdom. And he's the God of the living, not the God of the dead. This is glory today. Hallelujah. Amen. Yeshua, Yeshua, Shalom.